A man is dead after colliding his dirt bike with a Baltimore City fire truck. WMR2 News' Aaron McPherson is live this morning with details on that crash. Aaron. Well, Christian, we found out that fire truck was actually en route to another call with lights and sirens on when that crash happened. And the fire officials we spoke with tell us that everyone on that fire truck was visibly upset and shaken by the incident. Now, this crash happened before 8 o'clock last night at West Pratt and South Payson Street in the city. Investigators say the truck was traveling southbound on Payson Street while the dirt bike rider was traveling eastbound on Pratt Street. Police say the dirt bike rider did realize he was was going to run into the truck and tried to stop, but the two collided, killing the young man. None of the firefighters were hurt. We talked with a woman who saw it all happen, but didn't want to be identified. She says the bike rider was with another rider running a red light. She stressed dirt bikes have been a continuous issue in the city, and now she hopes that city leaders will do something about it to prevent someone else from getting hurt or dying. You obviously see they're going to do it. Give them an outlet. Stop having them ride the bikes in the middle of the street because now that's somebody's son, somebody's brother. He possibly got kids of his own. His family ain't going to see him no more. And all because there's nowhere for them to ride these bikes. And Baltimore City officials, whether it's Brandon Scott or even the police department, they don't do nothing. Now crash investigators are looking into exactly what happened last night. Police say there are several street cameras as well as a camera on the fire trucks. They're going to review all of that footage. For now, we're live here at Television Park. Aaron McPherson, WMAR 2 News.